And here comes Better Bia. Yes. Better Bia with thudding shot. With the left hand. Sweeping right hand drives down. Oh! Espinosa sending him back Espinosa. against the ropes! Ramirez with oh. time to go! Hey boys, if a cold break, you stop punching, you take a step back. Don't deliberately throw punches around the back of the head and protect yourselves at all times. Touch gloves. He doesn't have a high energy style. And that bodes well for a guy who's late in his 30s. Oh, there's a right hand that shook Anthony Yard. Here comes a left hook from Archer Better BF. He's starting to find a home for his shots. He's getting steady and he's starting to find openings in Anthony Yard, who's more steady. He's getting clipped. The legs underneath him are now wobbly. And here comes Archer Better BF. Told you, dominate mid range. It's a wrap now. There's a right hand from Archer Better BA. He just retired the beast, Joe Smith Jr. And now the beast from the East, Anthony Yard, is where he doesn't need to be, Dre, against the ropes. And Better Biev is starting to find his range. He's found Ooh. a range that's comfortable to fight in. Where Nice counter. Left hook there. And he hurt him with that. Hard. That buzzed to Better Biev a little bit. Can he capitalize on this moment? Anthony oh. Yardo gets caught with the right hand coming in, and that's the danger. You want to play with fire, you want to exchange with Archer Better be it? Well, you better be ready to take some fire in return. Oh! Big right hand. This is a fight, and it's a firefight, and anything can happen, and now it's Archer Better be it, who is taking a step back. Yard is doing a better job this time than he did in the Kovalev fight. He's not shooting everything that he has. He's not punching himself out. He's landing a good shot. He's marching forward. He'll land another two good shots. He knows that he can't afford to punch himself. <laughs> but here comes Better Bia. Yes. Better Bia with thudding shots. That's called experience. That's what you're seeing right now. Oh, experience. Nice uppercut from Archer Better Bia and the bell is the only thing that can separate these two men. And you got to talk him through these last seven rounds. Son, he's 38 years old. You can be tired tomorrow. You don't have time to be tired right now. Beautiful right hand from Anthony Yard. Sets Archer better be at reeling backwards towards the ropes. And now the champion turns Yard around. Has a couple of uppercuts. A beautiful right hand. Digs to the body. Uppercut. And here we see the firefight we anticipated. Both fights. Both fighters with their heart on their sleeve. Body nice shot is the key. The body is the key. Then go back to the head. Sometimes when you get hit to the body, it reminds you to go to the body, and that's what Anthony Yard just did. You can't move that torso, you can't move that body, especially when the opponent is up again. Good shot right there for his shot. Yard. Nice right hand, and now Yard is hurt! Archer better beat him! Puts him on the canvas! That's the punch that just missed about 30 seconds ago. For Anthony Yard to continue, how will he deal with the onslaught from the beast? Nope, and Tunde Ajayi steps in, and Archer Better BM does it again. 19 victories, 19 knockouts, eight championship fights. None have gone the distance because this man is a destructive force. Are good. There's the line there, there's the line there. Touch gloves, go back to your corner. Cover that one. I have to believe that that's what they specialize in. Ooh. Punch combination from Navarrete. Oh, oh, he got caught. Wilson catches him. And now Navarrete's hurt here in round four. Wilson on the attack. Massive underdog has a big opportunity. Oh. Wilson scores the shocking knockdown here in round four. Wilson's got to jump on him. Could Wilson pull the shocking upset? Right hand comes in. Tries to come back with the left hook. Navarrete is not tying up. Navarrete, a huge favorite, a two-division world champion. Wilson, a little-known Australian. Big right hand comes in. Final seconds. Navarrete is hurt, but survives. But perhaps didn't realize how much guts and desire is on oh! the oh! Wilson. He's hurt. Wilson did it again. Navarrete tries to fire back, but in these Good closing time. moments, Wilson's on the attack, and Navarrete is hurt again. This is not a knockdown. Oh, Navarrete mixing in that body shot again. That was wrapping oh. around that elbow. That was and me. Navarrete getting after it here to close out round seven. Oh, we got a great one tonight.
tonight, folks. Sit back and enjoy. But Navarrete rallied in the fifth, rallied in the seventh, and then does that here in the ninth. And will Navarrete, with all this time to work with, get after him? Lunging left hook. Wilson comes forward. Right hand behind the jab. Looking for that left uppercut. Signature punch of Navarrete. Right hand, uppercut, combination. Wilson's hurt, and he ties up. Now some separation, tries to land the left hook. Up jab. Navarrete tries to go underneath it. Seeking to become a three-division world champion. What a slugfest we have here. Long range bomb. Headshot rings in. Wilson holds up to it. Wilson clearly damaged here in round nine. Blood coming from his nose. He hasn't taken big shots. Headshot comes in again. Another big one from Navarrete. Navarrete with a left hand. Sweeping right hand drives down. Big headshot. Wilson's in deep trouble here. They gotta get in there. Big, big trouble. It could be ending in any moment. It's a lot of time left. He hasn't he's tied got, up he's got, a, he's got a shot with that left Does he know how to tie up? And he knows it. He possesses the lottery ticket. Tie up. He stumbled back. Tie up, Wilson. He stumbled back. Tie up. They gotta get in there. Headshots running down from Navarrete. Body shot mixed in. It is over. It is over. In an absolute thriller. Navarrete is a three division world champ. As a reminder, obey my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. If you want to touch him up, good luck. Good defense. Good prevent defense right there. Well, Loma wanted to come in, but the physical strength of Haney said no. Nice counter right there. And then Haney. the counter right hand from Off Devin the back Haney. foot. Oh, there's a combination from Loma. Getting mid-range. Loma closing that gap. And yeah, Loma, you want to keep doing what he's doing in his last Ooh. round and a half. Headshot lands. Keep pressing. Keep causing disruption. Keep trying to close the distance. And, and make Devin Haney Uppercut prove comes in. that he can do something about it. Southpaw jab set it up. And Loma with a combination here in the final minute of round three. Good body work. Right hand to the body again. Comes back with a left to the body. Then goes up top with a short right hand. Lomachenko with a three punch combination that was capped by a short left uppercut on the inside. Right Ooh. hand to the body again. Nice left change. uppercut Cutting comes cut. underneath with the right hand does Haney. The Let's way. see if he gets to the jab and stays on the outside. Oh, Loma! Left hand from Loma. Three shots. Comes in. Three left hands from Loma. When the fight gets interesting in a championship fight, the back half, the seventh round on. Now we see how there hard you train. Now we see what type of lifestyle you've been living. This is when it all comes out. And how bad you want it. Oh! He felt that. He caught him. That all came because Devin Haney picked up his jab and began to throw it. Loma's looking for a jab. A left hook came instead. Chopping down. Haney backs into that red oh, corner, comes out of it. Shot right there. With a Viper strike, Loma tries to close the distance. Again, straight left hand from Loma. Can't miss with the left hand. Oh, good shot. Got hurt. He there. hurt him Point with that. on the inside from Lomachenko. That hurt him. Lomachenko's best moment of the fight. It comes in round 10. Came out of nowhere. Explosive. Right on the target. I'm telling you. Accurate, sharp, quick. The smaller 35-year-old seems like the younger, bigger man. Two three-punch combination from Loma. Right in Haney's face, daring him to throw, daring him to shoot a shot because he's in range to counter and lead at will. That's the reason why Loma is having success. Oh, good body beautiful shot body shot. Look at this work shot. from Lomachenko. And still undisputed lightweight champion of the world, Devin the Dream Haney. And you can see the expression on Lomachenko's face. Tim Bradley he's circling around and going to that weak side. Good exchange right there. Excellent exchange. As Alpaw stands now, huh? He has switched a couple times tonight. Now. Oh, there it is! Oh, my. There it is! My! Robesi Ramirez lunging with it and brutalizing Espinosa. 
Ramirez now is finding a home. Now he's moving to his left, and he's looping his right hook over the jab. There it is again, no high on the temple. There's Good a left shot. Hand. Oh, and he stumbles. He's got him in trouble here. Closing moments of round seven. Well, this is his third fight in the United States. He's only fought past the six round oh, once. My and goodness. this kind of an effort. Oh. And now Ramirez is finding his groove. Target here practice. he comes. Look at the champ firing off against the big lanky target. And Espinosa still is punching. Oh, big he, shots. He's taking headshots and yet still firing at Ramirez. That's a smart thing to do. Espinosa closing the distance. Not allowing Ramirez to be able to extend either with that right hook or that looping left. Three punch combination from Espinosa. Ramirez with comes back with right the left hand. Espinosa trying to place that uppercut, drives a left hand of his own back. Ramirez counters with a left. Straight right hand from Espinosa. Headshot from Espinosa. Ramirez. Espinosa now turning it on more and more. Tess, this is why I love boxing, Tess. Just spectacular when there's drama like this. This is why I love boxing. You're seeing guts, you're seeing blood, determination. And you just never know on any given night from any opponent, anything can happen. Look at this in the final minute. Oh my goodness. Espinosa just saying, I'm going for it. I'm taking it to the champ in front of his fans. He has to do something. Espinosa sending him back Espinosa. against the ropes. Ramirez with oh! Scores the knockdown. This could be a massive upset. The two time Olympic gold medalist against the little known, rugged Mexican hopeful. He is in trouble right to the final bell. And the new WBO featherweight champion of the world, Rafael. True. Look at the emotion on the face of Rafael Espinosa.